And that is sample rate in 30 seconds, roughly. <laughs> Welcome back to Q&A Wednesdays. So we've had quite a few questions asking us what exactly is sample rate on oscilloscope and why is it in all the spec sheets? So let's quickly go over it. So sample rate is how a digital oscilloscope collects data. The analog signal that goes into your oscilloscope will look something like this. But a digital oscilloscope will take points of that data and then plot it to the screen so you can see it. So it take point here. And then what it will do with those points is it will draw between the dots and create the waveform on your screen. A higher sampling rate on your oscilloscope will see more points in a small amount of time, so it's better at seeing those really small signals. If you select a lower sampling rate on your oscilloscope, your data will look more like this. So if we pick just four points out of this, then all you would see in your oscilloscope display is these four points, which is not a lot of definition in your waveform. So more points means more resolution in the time axis. So when you're looking at oscilloscope specifications, you'll get a specification of the maximum sample rate. And that's basically the maximum sample rate that an oscilloscope can do. With that higher sample rate, you're able to look at much smaller signals like in the picoseconds or nanoseconds, which is better, but obviously is going to cost the consumer more. 